Hi guys and welcome to my desk where I'm trying to decide do I want the light colored file folders for my project which would be okay because I could ink them and bring out some color or do I want to go with the green greenish turquoise bluish color which goes great with this signature really good but I don't feel like it works with these ones so uh, moment of truth I think I'm gonna go with the cream colored ones and I'll leave these ones for other projects and I'll just ink these so we're gonna get started ASAP we're gonna get moving today I'm going to I've already cut out all the ephemera I am gonna print out a few more I think I messed up a couple of these inking them so I'm just going to cut out another whole set of the ephemera, maybe two of the mason jars, maybe two of the lined elements, just so I have enough, right? Because, and I suppose I could always come back and add, but I will be printing out more of this digital kit, and I will be putting, as I said, this will be one side of the journal as a you know front cover to the journal page this will be the middle um, I'm thinking because I want to set them up so that when you open the journal itself you see let me find my girl here you see it like this. This is the layout with this being the middle. And I think that was the only three that I had in mind. Yes, and the rest of them would be signature pages. So here's the thing. The more I cut, the more I have, right? Or the more I print. So I'm going to go with these three. And then I'll utilize these copies somewhere else in the journal because I'm actually thinking of the possibility of having this. Which one was it? Was it really this one? Pretty much my favorite. Either this one or this one with her on the front cover. Um, Bussy cut. Might be her. Yeah, I think it'll be this one and this one as fussy cut and then put on the front. Okay, so this one's going to be really special, guys. This one's going to have, like I said, because it's Ladies Home Journal, it's going to have all the bells and all the whistles. It's going to be like any um, Ladies Home Journal journal would have had everything, a place for her to talk about her journey and maybe her growth and um, parties and events and then so lovely would be let's see she's on the back and I could reverse that I suppose or flip it Ooh, you guys well no because this one doesn't have writing so it would be just like this okay so I might go, she's a little smaller, put her there on the plant. See, i got to figure all this out right there. Maybe her there with some lace or something behind her. Okay, so that I'll work on. Got to get my stuff straight here, though, because I keep dreaming and procra not procrastinating, but I just keep thinking of things that I could be putting in there. So I might do it this way. So left, middle, right. And then one is going to have correspondence, events, travel, etc., parties. One is going to be um, gardening and recipes. And then this one will be um, 
what's new you know things that are coming up maybe bridal showers however you want to do it but that's that's my image of how this should go okay so without further ado when we come back in the next video I'm going to have all my pieces and parts cut out and then we're going to I'll put in the signatures I'll have them inked laced whatever and then as we start to embellish the actual journal I will bring you along for the tutorials and um, decorative part of that using my stash and finishing off with um, items that I have on hand to put in the journal and then yay we'll do a flip through so hopefully I'll get all of this done today with that being said guys stick around um, as I've been saying I have uh, been getting my kits from decorateyourlife.com and I am on their design team and they have some events coming up throughout the remainder of the year I have some events that I'm going to be doing for decorate your life later in the year so um, I can't give exact dates at this time but I can tell you there's a lot coming up and you're going to want to jump over to her website www.decorateyourlife.com and I'll leave it in the description box as well as information for her assistant Jenny and how to reach Sandy on her website's Facebook channel etc. They have a lovely uh, Facebook channel as well and you're not going to want to miss it let me tell you this is a this is an exciting um, energetic group of ladies putting together exciting energetic projects and bringing those all to you with a wealth of knowledge and experience so please jump on over there and let's get started um, if you want to do this kit and do a craft along with me go to her website now I will be a few days before I get this out um, if you are needing for her to print this for you she does um, right now things are going a little bit she's getting things done guys but she's um, helping her husband recover from a surgery so all prayers and support are greatly appreciated do not let that stop you from getting over there and getting your order in she is getting those out so um, yeah don't miss out this is going to be crazy fun and I'm going to be bringing aboard um, some other uh, contest challenges just a lot of great stuff and um, I'm hoping you'll come along all right guys thanks for watching and don't forget get over there and get your order bye guys oh yes I'll have a 10% off discount code in the description box so on top of having all of this beautiful fodder at your fingertips you'll also get a 10% discount all right guys thanks for watching